Hi, today we'll be creating an XOOX lift and slide unit and taking a look at the opening scheme cross-section functionality. We start off by selecting our lift and slide system and our rectangular unit shape. Next, we quickly size the unit to our overall unit dimensions. Our unit is 4,000 mm wide by 2,000 mm tall. Once we have sized our unit, we add in our frame layer. Here we select the Frame XX layer template. After we have our frame layer, we add in a 4 sash divider mutton template. This allows us to split the layer into 4 sashes. After we have our divider, we can add in our sashes. We start off on the left side with a non-operable sash. Then we select our frame layer and add in our sliding left operable sash. Next, we add in our sliding right operable sash. And lastly, we add in our right side non-operable sash. Now, let's add some glass and glazing stops to our unit. We add it in by clicking fillings and then selecting the space that we want glass in. We then maneuver to the next layer by double clicking on it. We will repeat this process for all four layers. In this particular unit, we'll be adding 19 mm glass to the entire unit. We will also add modern glazing stops to the fixed sashes and OG glass stops to the center operable sashes. Lastly, we will add in the hardware by selecting our layers and choosing the slide direction. Let's take a look at some cross sections. First, we enable the cross sections in the View tab. Then, we create our cross sections. Here, we create one that goes horizontally through the entire unit and one that goes vertically across the left fixed sash. These cross sections are completely parametric, which allows us to apply certain schemes. We will enable the opening scheme for this unit. Thank you for watching. For more information concerning the latest Easy Window version, contact WB at www.wbsystech.com. Links will be in the description.